What's up YouTube? This your boy Sticks, and I'm back with a reaction video. Yo, check this out. If this is the first time you're coming across my channel, do me a favor. Hit that like and subscribe. Subscribe's up to you, but hit that like if you ain't a buster, a sucker, or a snake. I'd really appreciate it. Now to the 150 people that subscribe to my channel, I appreciate you more than you'll ever know. But the first things first, I need to address these haters just one more time, and that'll be the last time. I'm gonna go ahead and tell you, all my content is locked up related content for the simple fact I spent most of my 20s locked up, all right? So I feel like I'm making up for time I lost. But these people wanna jump in my comments and tell me about me. Like they know more about me than I know. Yeah, I'm not 20s no more, but you can miss me with that hate comment, all right? Because when I was making this channel, I reached out to other YouTubers for pointers and advice, and none of them got back to me. I made something shake out of nothing. Everything I'm doing right now, I learned on my own. I learned this on my own. So, once it grows and blows, because there's only one way for this channel to go, and that's up. I started with zero. You understand that, right? And these videos are just going to get better and better because I'm just starting off. I'm just learning how to do this shit. I'm basically learning how to use technology, period. Computers and shit like that. So, if you don't like it, man, just get out of here for real. But to the people that do like my videos or see I'm trying to do something here, I appreciate you guys. I appreciate the comments, all the love you guys been giving me. I really do. But look, a little hate, I'm not going to just stop doing my channel. You got to understand, I'm doing this for a reason. So, this video I have for you today, it's going to be a short video. The next video I'm doing is going to be a really good video. I'm working on that right now, but somebody has shared this to me on TikTok. And I felt obligated to put it out as soon as possible because people need to know about these type of police officers that abuse their power. They put their little uniform on, they got their badge, and all of a sudden they're better than everybody else. But the thing is, I know there's good cops out there doing the right thing, trying to help out the community. But then you have these police officers that make every other police officer look bad. So let's go. Hush, hush, babe. Hush, babe. Hush, babe. Hush. Hush, babe. Hush. 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 Hush, babe. 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 I'm pretty sure as soon as they come up to your car, they have to tell you why they pulled you over. As for your license and stuff like that before they could just snatch you up out of the car and start pointing a taser at you. Now I know this video starts right here, so we didn't get to see what happened in the beginning. But clearly, this man doesn't even know why he's being pulled over. Shh, let's go. Not the first time no, I'm not. You're gonna lose your job. You wanna know why? Why? You think you know the law, but you don't. Turn around before you get taken. Baby, turn around! He said, you think you know the law, but you don't. I think the police officer don't know the law. He needs to tell this guy what is the issue. Is, does he look like somebody, a robbery suspect, something like that? Just tell this man what your issue is so that you guys can get off of that whole why am I being pulled over thing. I got a feeling this one is going to end bad. Don't even clap with these folks. Just turn around. Fuck them. Just turn around. Like, what you mean? I ain't threatening a knife. Don't move. For what? Turn around, baby. Because I'm getting pissed off. What? Now, I know this guy's got an attitude, but it's because he doesn't even know why this officer is putting handcuffs on him. Anybody would be upset if an officer just starts handcuffing you and you have no idea why 
I'm pretty sure they have to tell you why you're being detained. Put it in the comments. Let me know. Is this police officer in the right? Or is this driver in the right? I want to know. Let's go. Your phone. What? No. Like turn around for me. Do not shoot him. Uh -uh. Do not shoot him. Look how the guy's on the ground, hands behind his back and everything. Put the handcuffs on him. Or what, you just prolonging this whole thing so you could tase this man again? And the girl screaming? I get it. She's scared. Police officers are known for killing people, overreacting. And this cop definitely overreacted. Let's go. What you putting us over for? Can somebody help us? Can you please help us? Somebody help us. Can somebody help us? Can somebody help us? Can somebody help us? Man, I just really feel bad for this couple right now. Can you call the police on the police? Because if you ask me, this cop had no right to tase this man at all. He, yeah, he, he was, he was mad. You know, he said he was getting pissed off, but he wasn't trying to hurt the officer in any way. He didn't, clearly didn't have weapons. Looks like this guy, he doesn't even have his shoes on. I'm not sure what we missed in this video. But this is one of those cops that make all the other cops look bad. And this girl crying out for help, it's terrible. Because who do you get help from when the people that's put in power to help you are the people that's hurting you? Everybody needs to share this video. Everybody needs to get this out because this type of shit right here, it has to stop. It happens too much. And just luckfully, he didn't shoot this guy. He just used his taser. But still, did he really need to do that? There's way too many cops out here abusing that badge. But look, until next time, hold your head. Stay out of lockup.